Welcome to Find BI Training for Beginners Chapter 7, Dashboard Layout and Beautification. Through the previous analysis, we have obtained the information we want. Next, we need to show the analysis results to our colleagues, so we also need to beautify the dashboard. We can see that some components belong to the same theme. For example, top 10 products by sales and sales percentage of different commodity categories are the analysis of sales, while gross profit chain growth rate and gross profit chain growth rate 1 are the analysis of gross profit. We can put the components of the same theme under the same tab by using the tab component in Find BI. Click the Other button in the upper left corner and drag a tab component into the dashboard. There is a default tab and we can drag the two components of sales analysis into it and then change its title to sales analysis. By clicking on the nearby plus sign, we can add a new tab. Drag the two components of gross profit analysis into the new tab and rename it as gross profit analysis. Now, we can look up different analysis by switching between different tabs. To make the overall layout neat and beautiful, we can adjust the size and position of the components in the dashboard by dragging and dropping them. So far, a sales report has basically taken shape. If we want to add a title to this report so that viewers can quickly understand its main contents, then we can add a text component to the dashboard. Click the Other button in the upper left corner, find the text component and drag it to the top of the dashboard. Then adjust the size of the text component and input the Tile XX Supermarket Sales Report. We can also change the color, size and style of the texts. In addition, if we want to add some external links as supplementary description of the dashboard, we can add hyperlinks to the text in the text component. For example, after entering the text click here to go to the supermarket official website, we can select the text, click the add a link button and input the address in the link URL box. By clicking the text, we can jump to another website. We may not be satisfied with the overall style of the dashboard, so we can click on the above dashboard style button to make a change. There are many preset styles, which can be switched by clicking on them. Of course, you can also select a custom dashboard style. After setting the custom style, you can also save it as default style for reuse next time. The style of the tab component can also be modified. By clicking on the tab component and then the style button on the right, you can set the title, background and style of the tab component. Here we want to hide the title of the component, so we uncheck the option and click OK, thus, the entire dashboard is finished. 